guys, thank you for checking out my channel. Today I'll be doing a car tour of my 2019 Jeep Grand Cherokee. It's the limited edition, uh, two by four wheel drive, and I hope you like this video. First starting off, I'll just show you guys a little bit about the outside of the vehicle. There is a white exterior and there's all black interior. There's a chrome grill on the front of the vehicle and also chrome wheels. And I'll show you a little bit more here. So here's just the um, logo of the vehicle, which is the Grand Cherokee logo. And then there's also uh, sensors on the side of the vehicle. This is the side view mirrors here. And the side view mirrors lights up whenever you make a right turn, a left turn, and they're also chrome. So basically the entire exterior of the vehicle is chrome and white. And as you can see, this is the back of the vehicle. Um, and just to give you guys a little tour of this, basically my spare tire is under here and I always keep a pair of heels just in case you have to um, jet to an interview or anything such as in the back of my vehicle and also a blanket for my dog and a pillow for me just in case I need to um, boost myself and this is just a seat pillow for the front and driver's side of my vehicle and in the back you'll see that we have a cigarette lighter plug and basically you can charge things back here it could be an air mattress it could be any a phone it could be anything that you would like to put back here and that's just a, a cigarette lighter charger outlet and my favorite part about the back is and I may sound crazy but I do a lot of grocery shopping especially considering my boyfriend does it so these are the hooks for the groceries and so you just hook the bags on the side of here and you're good to go. Um, speakers on both sides. And after all of that is done, you do have hooks on both sides for bags if you need to not have anything rattling in the back. I have definitely found that as an issue for me. When you're finished, all you need to do is press this button here and this button will automatically uh, allow the back to come down. Okay, so you have control panel in the inside of your vehicle. You can um, alter the channel of the station that you're listening to or change the Pandora music that you want or anything such as using the back uh, buttons here. If you can see, okay, zoom in. And there's also volume. And I believe that's on the left side of the vehicle, right behind your um, front wipers. And call and call here on your vehicle there's also a set for um, cruise control and I was never a fan of that I really never had an advanced luxury vehicle such as this and I've been through my share of vehicles but I will say that this is definitely handy especially if you're uh, planning on going out of town or if you're um, on the highway for a long period of time and so I just got a small little Brookstone phone holder here this helps me as far as navigation and also the vehicle does come with that but usually i just use my phone and this is the air vents the vents obviously and you can just twist it to your preferences and i'll show you guys a little bit about the panel here and also the middle console so the radio obviously you have an option to go to uh, series xm you can obviously subscribe to that you also have the option to you am fm and um set your own channels above here and map it'll show you exactly where you are it'll show you um you know where your navigation is going and then media allows you to sync in your aux your usb one and two and your bluetooth and um climate control is something that i find definitely convenient because if someone on your passenger side is not as um if they're not as cold, not as warm as you are, then they can alter their own settings on their own side. So such as this. So if your passenger is hot or cold and they want the heat on, then they'll turn that up. And if I'm cold, 
I'll turn mine to low. And it that is just that easy. You literally do feel the difference. Um, this is the knob to control the the um, maximum, minimum fan blow of your heat or your air. Here are the apps that you have on your vehicle. Everything that you really want to control your vehicle with is basically on this screen. The only bad thing about this screen is just that it does not, um, it has so many uh, fingerprints after you touch it for such a long period of time. And so I'm thinking about getting a screen protector for that. And also a good thing for this vehicle is the heated steering wheel. So the heated steering wheel allows you to, you know, stay warm, especially in a cold clim climate and considering it's winter right now. And then um, also the backup camera, you can just, you know, just see what's going on behind you just in case you may be waiting in the car for something and you just kind of want to make sure you're aware of your surroundings. And here is the screen off button. If it gets too bright for you, you can simply click that. Um, this is the radio tune on, radio tune off, and mute button, so you get a phone call quickly. Hazard lights, volume, air, uh, parking is here is the lights, it's automatic lights, power lights, brights, all of what you need here. And it also would adjust on your um, dashboard as well. Uh, this is the gas gauge, the cold and hot gauge, the miles per hour, and all the rest of the stuff here. And um, basically, this is your push to start. And your middle console. And this is just two cup holders, um, your clutch. And all I keep here is just one of my stones, also some chapstick, and this is all velvet in the inside. I have a little sand in here because I recently went to the beach. And inside of here is a big glove department where you will have your typical things. For me, I'm just having a mask and a charger in there at this time. <clears throat> and then there's also like a little secret part here where you can just like throw your license or registration, anything like small like that, or um, perhaps uh, anything that's convenient, an ID, a badge to get into your job. And this is the little console or the glove department. Sorry, what's wrong with that? And this is just my bag telling me about the vehicle and a couple of gift cards I have in here. So here onto my panoramic sunroof. This is the uh, garage opener here, one, two, and three. Uh, this is for the uh, actual glass. This is for the actual cover. So here we go. Okay, so that's basically the cover there. And then also, if you want a little bit of air, you can open that. And it's just an open experience there. It doesn't go all the way back, but it's very convenient. Very convenient. So guys, this is the end of the video. I want to thank you all for checking out my channel. If you are interested in knowing a six month update on me and owning the vehicle, um, I also probably will be uploading a video of me um, just kind of customizing the vehicle and just adding my own personal touch to it with seat covers and um, the screen protector. So if you're interested in that, just let me know in the comments below. Um, thank you all for watching my channel. Please subscribe. Please turn on your notification. I hope you have a Godspeed and a blessed day. Thank you.